What's going on, you guys? Well, I've seen a lot of these questions asking everybody out there in the wrestling community. And I figured I think I should ask everybody out there some of these questions. Feel free to spread it around. We'll see what everyone else thinks. All right. Question number one. The entrance that stuck out to you the most, you know, that made you go, whoa, now that was cool. I can't show you the entrance, but I can play you the music at least. The Brood. You know, that entrance in the Attitude Era was whew, Edge, Christian, Gangrel coming up from the stage with a ring of fire. Just amazing, you know. It was by far one of the best entrances of all time. So creative, whoever came up with that, genius. Next, which wrestler you have met that was by far the nicest and most coolest person you have met ever? That right there, Hulk Hogan was mine, you know. Met him a couple years back. He had over 1,500 people in line waiting to meet him. It was a hot summer day in New England. It can get buggy real quick. And a lot of people were like, Ugh, so hot. Uh. But he stayed and met every single person. He had a, It was a two-hour hour time limit. He just got, it started around 10 my time. And it ended, I think, around 1.30ish my time. And he stayed for everybody. And I think that's really cool. And it was free. The autographs were free. But if you have not met a wrestler, how about who's the one guy or diva you want to meet? If you can only pick one, they could be a current superstar or past. Next, if you own DVDs, which ones are your favorite? Now, it's hard for me, so I had to come up with five. I'm just going to show you them. Here's one. The legacy of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Two. Road Warriors. By far one of the greatest tag teams of all time. And sadly passed away recently, but Roddy Roddy Piper bond, born to controversy. You Think You Know Me, The Story of Edge. And the Heart and Soul, our family anthology. If you don't have much DVDs, have you seen any of them on the network? Which ones are your favorites? Which ones do you like to watch a little more? Sorry, my cat is just making a little cameo here. Alright, uh, let's see. Another question to ask you, people out there. Hmm, your favorite match of all time? Now, there's so many, but I can two of them come to my mind. WrestleMania 25, Undertaker, and Shawn Michaels. Don't have to explain there. And um, when I witnessed live, had to be Edge and John Cena last man standing match, Backlash 09. That was amazing live. Uh, back and forth, you know. Cena always has great matches with Edge. And back and forth, back and forth. By far one of the best. And something I'll never forget. And I was just glad to be there. If you have not seen it, I'm sure there's clips of it on YouTube. If, if you don't want to go on YouTube and you're on the network, check out Backlash 09. You'll see this face a couple of times. Alright. Now, here's some questions that are non-wrestling related. Shocking. What movie is your favorite of all time? I would have to say mine is either the Indiana Jones movies or Back to the Future. Amazing. What kind of music are you into? I'm into anything with rock. I can listen to some rap, but I mostly like rock music. Next. What is your favorite wrestling shirt that you own? I had so many, but if you saw previously, my Hulk Rule shirt is my favorite because it just makes me think of the time when I met him because he was wearing this shirt, which was pretty cool. 
Next, your favorite wrestling moment. Mine has to be, honestly, it deals with Hulk Hogan again, but when he came back in the NWO, I thought this was going to be a great thing. I was hoping the NWO would be good in WWE because I thought it was good in WCW for the, until it started getting overused. Next, if you had the opportunity to make anyone the champion currently, right now, who would it be? But if you are happy with the current champion, who is currently Seth Rollins, if you're watching this right now, in 2015 in September, but if you could make anyone champion, whether they be from NXT or TNA or anywhere, who would you want to be currently the WWE champion? Honestly, I think I would like to see Kevin Owens as the champion. You know, he's a great on the mic right now. He's a great heel. On, um, I'm glad he's the IC champion. Next. If you could put anybody in the Hall of Fame that is not in the Hall of Fame right now, who would it be? And the person I could think of, honestly, is Owen Hart. Owen Hart was one of the greatest wrestlers to never hold the WWF or WWE title. He held every title. I believe he was the European champion. I could be wrong, but he was never the WWE champion. And it's a shame. I thought he could have been a great champion. I kind of wish he beat Brett for the title. And they could have kept that feud going, but didn't. Next. If you could bring back one pay-per-view back, what would it be? I would bring back the King of the Ring. The King of the Ring was one of the most exciting pay-per-views of all time. It was better as a pay-per-view. I do like the Raw ones when they do it now and then, but... I liked it as a pay-per-view. Next, your favorite Royal Rumble moment. Mine has to be... Hmm. Has to be the Edge and Dolph Ziggler match from 2011. Yeah, I was there. So it was an honor to see Edge one more time before he had to retire. Sorry for all this. My cat is interrupting this video as we speak. Um, let's see, what else? How about non, non-wrestling non related? Favorite sport? I like baseball and football. I'm a Red Sox and Patriots fan. You guys can hate on the Patriots all you want. It's all about fun and games to me, you know? Alright, next. If you can book a match, your dream match, taking anyone you want past or present, and put them in the match together. Who would you want? Me? I would like to s finally see Stone Cold and CM Punk. That would have been a great match. It would have been a great draw. But another match I would have loved to have seen would have been Daniel Bryan and Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels trained Daniel Bryan, and I think it would have been great to see that happen. All right. Now, here is the last question I could think of. And you guys could add to it if you want. It's up to you. And leave it in the comment, the question you got, and I'll answer it. The last question I can think of. Who are the five wrestlers that you always want to meet? They can be sadly passed away, or they could currently wrestle, or they could be retired. My five, in no particular order, are Edge, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, Roddy Piper, and The Undertaker. Now, guys, that's all I can think of for questions. So, thank you for those who participate. Feel free to upload your own video. And let me know in the comments when you have uploaded, and I'll gladly check it out. And if you have more questions for me... Put them in the comments, and I'll answer them. And feel free to share this around. Let's see how many people we can get to do this. All right, guys. Until the next one, catch you later.